An unidentified man came onto the porch of a home in Denver's Capitol Hill neighborhood early Saturday morning and defecated. It was all captured on a doorbell camera. It's one of the last things Scott McCoy expected to see while skiing in the mountains over the weekend. He was skiing, when the notifications started popping up on his phone. I'm on Gondola 1, heading back down at the end of the day. You don't know whether to laugh or cry. McCoy told KDVR. Through 41 different doorbell videos on his phone, he watched the incident happen. He says it appears the man was intoxicated. First the man rings the doorbell, then tries to break into the home just before 2 a.m. Next, he goes over to a corner of the porch and defecates on it, and then spends the next few hours stumbling and spreading feces all over the porch. Unfortunately, he then touches lots of furniture, other parts of the wall, and a window. That's how we ended up with the current situation where there is excrement all over the porch. McCoy said, as he flipped through various videos of the incident on his phone. Initially you're a little bit angry that someone has violated your front porch, someone has soiled up your front porch, he added. McCoy lives in South Capitol Hill, and suspects the man came from a nearby bar or Christmas party. He does not believe the man is homeless. He's waiting for police to file a report first, before touching any of the evidence. I did put a little apology sign up, just because I imagine the mailman and others that stop by will wonder what in the world happened on this porch, he said, referencing a sign taped to one of Ottomans on the porch. In the meantime, he's posted to Facebook and next door, seeing if anyone knows this man. Most people responded to the post with puns, but he's gotten a few tips. A person who has a cousin that works at a bar pretty close to here, offered to contact that person and see if they recognized him. Another person thought they might have recognized him from a dating app, if you can believe that. Despite the tainted porch, and a lock that now needs to be fixed, McCoy says he's not looking to press charges. I don't know that this person, maybe they lost their job, maybe their girlfriend dumped them. Maybe they have a sick parent, and this drinking had something to do with that. That would make it more understandable. I'd certainly love to make contact with them and get an apology, if that's what they want to do, or maybe get an extra hand cleaning up the porch tomorrow," he added.